I know I look crazy. It's Tiffany with Thrifty Tiffany, and I am going to be putting together my new bed. I have a new gold bed frame that I got from Walmart.com, and I love it. And I'm so excited to show you guys. No makeup here. I'm getting real comfortable with this no makeup, y'all, but we are around the house. I still have boxes here. My room is definitely not all the way put together, and I'm excited to put this together. I'm already out of breath because the thing is heavy. <laughs> so we're gonna get started and I'm gonna put music over this while we put it together. My hair is crazy. Here we go, y'all.
gold. So this is what it looks like. And I'm about to put my mattress on it. You don't have to have a box spring because it has these and some metal slats. And it can go two different heights. So there's smaller ones right there that I could have used or taller ones here. Now, if you do use the taller ones, that means that your mattress is gonna come up higher on here and you won't have as much as a headboard. But I had already put the tall ones on before I realized that. So we're just gonna work with it. <laughs> if I think it doesn't look right, I'll change to the small ones, but that will be a process. But I love it. It did take a little bit. I did it by myself. Go me. <laughs> and I will show you when my bed, when I put hey my mattress. So I got the mattress on there. Came and helped me. We got it on there. I gotta get that tag over there sticking out. But I also wanted to show you guys these sheets that I got from Ross, I believe. Yes, Ross. King, King six piece sheet set. And this pretty, pretty mauve color. Let me bring it over here so I can show you guys. It's a pretty mauve color. And yes, it was from Ross for $19.99, which was a really good deal. So I'm about to wash these right now. That's why you hear the washer in the background. I'm about to wash these while they're gonna wash while I'll take the boys to football practice. And I have had questions. I am still using the Lowell mattress. I absolutely love it and it sleeps so good and I wouldn't change it for the world. I love this, love, love, love this mattress from Lowell. Okay, here's the finished product. I got my bed together. I hung up my favorite little antique picture I got from an antique store. I absolutely love it. And you can see the different types of gold from like the gold of my bed to the gold of like the frame. So it's kind of like a, I don't know, it's a different type of gold. Um, and I have my same lamp and same French provincial furniture that I had before. Um, these are some roses that Kaya gave me and they have died, but they died gracefully. I've had them for years and during the move, they broke a little bit right there, but they're still hanging on. And I love that little vase that I have it in that says, mom, I kind of wanted this room to be more simplistic. So I kind of got rid of a lot of things and I am definitely looking for another comforter. I love this color right here. The light's throwing it off, but it's more of a rustic dusty rose, if that even makes sense. It kind of has like a little brown hue with pink and dust. It's kind of what it looks like. Um, I love the bed. The bed came out great. I'm so excited to be able to sleep in a bed tonight. I've been sleeping on the floor on the mattress, but I love it. It came out great. I did it myself proud of myself so I'm sure you saw that through this video but this is the finished product and I I got this I have had question I got this comforter that I have currently right here this like duvet type comforter from TJ Maxx it's like a it's a mauve but like a pale pink type of mauve I'm trying to move towards this one to match the wreaths that I have um, so yes, I am obsessed with this and I will eventually do a room tour. I'm not all the way done. I still have boxes. Yep, right there, not showing those. <laughs> but um, so this is what I have done so far and I am just so happy my bed is together. Okay y'all, so I'm just gonna go ahead and give y'all a sneak peek of this side of the room. I'm not completely done, but this is the color that I'm looking for. I actually got the wreaths and this garland right here from Target, the Hearth and Hand collection. And it's like a mauve, um, I can't explain this color. It's like mauve and it has some light to it, but then it has some browns. I am obsessed with that color right there. So I just kind of set this up before at my old house. I had a whole bunch of stuff on my dresser and I wanted to simplify it. So I simplified it. And this is all that I have on the dresser and I have those two so and then I have a mirror right there as well but I'll show the whole room reveal later this was just as you can see I have boxes still right here um so yes so this is what I have so far and this French provincial furniture is like the same furniture I had when I was a little girl this is not the set I bought this set a couple years ago but I had like the same type a lot of people redo it I will eventually paint this one. It hasn't turned all the way yellow yet. It does have like 
It's, it has a hint of yellow to it, but it's not like yellow, yellow. So I'm gonna hang on to it naturally as long as I can. And the reason why is because I love the gold trim of it and it just looks really antique and pretty. And so that is it, that is my dresser. So that's kind of the color that I'm going for. I'm obsessed with it.